guys, this is Katie with the channel Weather Spazify. Welcome if you're new and a big hello to my returning subscribers. Uh, right now I'm at one of my favorite lakes and it's near sunset or sundown as you can see behind me. And there is some beautiful fall foliage behind me as well. You can see a bunch of the uh, yellow and orange and all the cool colors of fall as we move into November. Um, I thought I would go ahead and do some energy clearing in this video and bring some uh, Reiki healing and kind of heal and align our chakras and kind of do a little bit of ASMR triggers as well. I brought a few crystals and some tools along with me. So uh, one of the first things that I have with me is a home clearing and blessing kit. And basically what's in here is a piece of sage, Palo Santo or Palo Santo and a white little chime candle. And these are great tools for beginning any session for any kind of clearing work. And normally what I would do in a session is I would light Palo Santo or sage and I would go ahead and smudge and smoke sage the area to just go ahead and clear any negative energies that are not serving us. Um, but for the sake of this video, I'll go ahead and just share with you, take these out of the bag what they look like. So this is what a sage bundle looks like, white sage. It's very purifying. Mm, and it's got such a nice aroma to it. <laughs> and Palo Santo. This is amazing stuff right here. It's got a really nice light, sweet, fruity aroma to it. And it's very sacred to the Native Americans. And it's been known to be very healing spiritually, emotionally, mentally, and physically. And normally what I would do is light the tip and then I would do some uh, smudging work too with this. And it's really good for um, opening up our chakras and healing them or sealing them up and protecting us from anything outside of us that we want to um, just protect ourselves from. And some people actually uh, shave some of the wood off of these sticks into hot water and make it into a Palo Santo tea and it's been known to have great anti-inflammatory properties. I went ahead and just circled around the top of your head or the camera three times to just bring in that soothing, calm, clearing energies. Now what I am going to do is I'm going to use the selenite wand to clear your energy and to soothe your mind through the camera, pretending that your camera is your physical body and your auric field. I'm going to go ahead and help clear your energy from the crown down to the root chakras. But first I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to just go ahead and clear my auric field. After just doing some tapping on here to calm our minds. Okay, 
So usually what I do is I start this way and let's see, three times over the crown and then I'll go to third eye and then I'll go to the throat and then the higher heart, the middle heart region, the solar plexus, the sacral, and then the root or base chakra. And then what I like to do is do this where I can just brush off anything else from my auric field. And what's great about selenite is you can really just feel how pure and how uh, cleansing this energy really is. Selenite is a very high vibratory or high vibration crystal known to help uh, raise you up into a frequency that is close to the angelic realms. So with that said, I'm going to go ahead and um, open up and clear your crown chakra and go from the crown down. So this energy will transfer from me to you and from the selenite wand to you through the camera. So just sit back and relax and enjoy. you feel a little bit lighter, more clear, cleared and opened up. And I also have this amazing special crystal with me. It's called Auralite. AUR 23 and it's got more than 23 minerals in it or at least 23 it's got gold silver amethyst fluorite it has quartz smoky quartz and a whole list of other crystals really cool about this piece is that there are triangles at the top on each side. There's a triangle there, there, this facet, there, and there. And if you look even more closely, you can see that there are downward pointing triangles on this facet.
can serve like a wand and it can direct energy towards you. So I'm going to direct some calm, soothing energy your way to this crystal, similar to what I did with the selenite wand. So just sit back, relax, and enjoy. Next. 
absorbs and absorbs negative harmful EMFs. And this crystal right here, this is a quartz point that's been infused with gold and titanium and other elements to create this lustry rainbow-like effect. And that increases our vibrational frequency and brings in more divine white light. So this is great for just balancing the yin and yang energies. So I'm going to go ahead and just swing this around. You just follow with your eyes and hopefully it will help relax any tension or anxiety you've had in today. Just follow it slowly. solar plexus. 
plexus chakra, the yellow flower of life, supports our sense of self, our personal power, and our willpower, as well as our knowing of who we are and what our contribution is to the whole. So, this is what the card looks like, but mostly look at the shape. It's the flower of life. It's orange-yellowish. This is our solar plexus chakra. Keep in mind, self-empowerment, going within, doing some meditation, thinking of what it is you are meant here to do, your soul purpose, your soul mission, and start stepping into it through radical action, or just going out and starting to meet like-minded individuals, and just putting yourself out there more and speaking your truth, whether that's through you. Subscribe, and I hope you have a wonderful, blessed rest of the